for you guys. Um, looking ahead to to A and M. It seems like uh, Dana Dana talked about giving you guys some time off, letting everybody relax, get healthy again. Do you feel Do you feel back to normal right now? Uh, definitely. Um, we've been working really hard in the weight room, uh, trying to get stronger uh, for the bowl. So uh, right now we're dead, but uh, once we get our little break. Uh, we should be rebooted up and ready to go. How about you personally, health-wise? I mean, dealing with some stuff towards the end of the regular season, obviously able to come back from that. Do you feel good right now? Uh, definitely. I feel 110%. Um, did a lot of rehab for the ankle and just other parts that I felt needed to work on and uh, feeling pretty good. I talked to a lot of your defensive guys. They said the difference between what A&M does offensively and what you guys do offensively is that you're much more versatile with being able to run the ball. Can you talk about that and the aspect that brings to this offense and, and kind of how that's helped you guys this year? Um, it's helped uh, at times keep uh, two people, Bracken and Kevin or Mario, and I uh, feel like uh, it's a big part of our offense now that Skyler's running the ball too. And uh, I feel like Skyler helps me a lot by him running and they're not just worried about the running back running the ball. So uh, I feel like it's a, it's a big key to our offense. They just a game time decision for your quarterbacks without giving anything away. Can you kind of compare, contrast what both guys do and really the, the finish that Skyler had to that season, the confidence that gives you guys going forward? Um, Clint came out strong, uh, got hurt, uh, supported football. Uh, Skyler played his role, stepped up, made big plays when we needed him to, uh, finished strong against Iowa State, and I think he's a great player too. So uh, whoever's out there, I'm not worried about it. Looking at this bowl game as a chance to kind of for a springboard for yourself, you know, the way you finished the season at Iowa State and moving into the offseason? Uh, definitely. Uh, I feel like we're going to have a great uh, opponent, um, SEC team. Uh, they're not a team that just think, all right, we're going to go in there, have fun, and not even worry about the game. Uh, it's definitely a, a, where we can make a statement and uh, definitely where I could show everyone that I just didn't save everything for the end of the year. How did you find out about Dawson and Eagle now? Uh, last night on Twitter, I guess. You, you found out on Twitter. What was your reaction to that? I mean, surprised that, that he was going to be moving on? Uh, yeah, um, but I mean, I guess at this level, it's a, it's a business. Um, I ain't mad at him. Uh, <laughs> I don't have any grudges against him. Uh, you got to do what's best for him and his family. He just had a daughter, so I can't be mad at him all.